Want to hear it singing? Yeah. Okay. Sing. That's Sing. Right. Belt it out. Cantor Benzian Miller began his singing career at the age of five, often accompanying his father, Cantor Aaron Miller, at public gatherings. He is one of a few Orthodox cantors dedicated to perpetuating the great virtuoso cantorial styles and traditions of the 19th and early 20th centuries. The producer for Decca Records heard one of the recording sessions in one of the concerts with Benzian Miller. He'd never heard this kind of singing before. He said, you know, if you weren't Orthodox, I would take him by the hand now at his age and he into uh, Decca Records and say, this is a discovery, be the best Rossini tenor in the world. Cantor Miller's brilliant tenor voice and astonishing vocal technique have been highlighted in more than 30 works recorded around the world for the Milken Archive. They're all famous pieces, right? Yes. I mean, you've, you've heard them all your life? And I sang them all my life. Ever since I was a little boy, I, I sang them. A landmark recording of Josela Rosenblatt's Tall featured Cantor Miller and the London Synagogue Singers. I found two voice sopranos. You get really a wonderful, wonderful flavor here, together with the, with the men's chorus. While in London, Cantor Miller recorded two liturgical pieces, Amar Rabbi Eliezer by Moshe Oisher and Sheya Hibane Beit Hamikdash by Israel Shore with Marios Papadopoulos conducting the Oxford Philo Musica. Just warming up, right? That's what I'm doing. Okay, that's good. Musically, they're beautiful. And of course, I'm introduced to a style that is just totally new to me. I'm glad to be his initiator, <laughs> to bring him into the counter. It was a lot of fun. I will tell you, while he was recording, the administrator, very aristocratic, silver-haired, uh, Catalan woman, came and just listened a bit, and she started to cry. She absolutely had tears in her eyes. We want you to come back and record anytime. I hope that these recordings will very much have an impact on synagogue music, and people hear how it can sound that people will want to increase the level of music in their own congregations throughout the country. Ben Sion Miller, someone who has absorbed the cantorial practices of great cantors of the golden age, has amalgamated this into a marvelous style of his own and one of the most thrilling voices of our time.